The news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Remember to follow us on all our social media platforms on Instagram, Prince Miller Entertainment, Facebook, our Prince Miller Entertainment, Facebook group, our Prince Miller Entertainment TV. We're available on Twitter at P Miller ENT. Follow us on Twitter and we follow back. Welcome to another edition of our daily news, breaking news, everyday news. And so guys, uh, citizens are coalition for change at Triple C MPs elected received a baptism of fire on their first day in parliament yesterday after they turned up in a yellow attire for the swearing in ceremony. Then PF MPs protested ag- accusing the opposition of coming to the August House dressed in party galia. Yellow is the Triple C party official color. But Speaker of the National Assembly, Jacob Denda, squashed the objections, saying there was nothing amiss since the Triple C members' attire had no party symbol. If there is no visible party symbol, it can be allowed in the House. Mudenda ruled before Clerk of Parliament Kennedy Chokuda proceeded to swear in the 28 legislators who were elected in the March 26 by elections. The Triple C MPs who were sworn in included Tedebiti, Arara East, Settlement Chikwina, Mbizo, Prince Dubeko Sibanda, Binga North, Amos Shibaya, Mkoba, Williams Mazumure, Kambuzuma, Shoton Wende, Kwazana East, among others. The NPF also had nine MPs sworn in who included uh, Zalia Makari Epworth, Mishek Mugaza, Mutasa South, Jeremiah Chuetu, Marondra East, Nyasha Masoka, Murewa South, Munyaradzi Zijou, Chivi South, Master Makope, Mwenez East, Mube Musa, Cholocho South, David Masushi, Gokwe Central, and Tasara Wongwe, Engwa South. Some of the seats became vacant following recalls initiated by MDCT leader Douglas Monzora. While others were a result of deaths and posting of MPs as ambassadors, the newly formed Triple C party begged 19 seats while Zanu PF got 9. But Engwa South legislator Tasara Wongwe, Zanu PF said, I promise to go back to my constituency and ensure there's there is communication with regards to things happening in parliament. Kwekwe Central MP Judith Atobaiwa, Triple C, said she would fight to end machete violence in the Midland city. Her constituency is where Triple C supporter Bongen Ngube was killed at a campaign rally in February. We are also going to address issues of uh, child abuse and child marriages. Young girls are being married off due to poverty and we need to end that, Atobaiwa said. Mugaza then PF said the people will not re- regret their choice. I will take the constituency to another level in terms of development. Kulumani MP Kukakapul Triple C said people from his constituency would benefit from his representative role as an MP by getting feedback on what is happening in parliament. Yes, those are the things that we want to hear as the voters. And are you guys coming back to us? Um, she told the farmers of parliament development. I mean, I say, and uh, yes, you guys you need to come back, keep us in, up to date, keep us informed about latest news. You get to come parliament where much it would go to our camera, so so camera this, so camera that, and they are not going to uh more disappear. Most of the battery got it, um, Nana November, October, Madak Votera Zakari next year. Could move pinders are in parliament. Are Saga, you know, we expect you guys to come back to us and inform us and, uh, you know, be part of us because it's also this one for Teraguti, move my MPs. So we, we look forward uh, towards your promises that you did promise us. Yes, or you, you promised us, and yeah, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. Saga, yeah, we wait to hear uh, your feedback. So guys, this is a daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload on this channel. And yeah, so this is a daily news, breaking news, everyday news. Thank you very much for listening and watching. Bless you.